Well, I'm Garfield Bird, and my official title is the Chief of Finance and Administration here for the Wikimedia Foundation. Our goal is basically to make accessible to everyone the sum of all human knowledge. We don't bring in anywhere near the, the amount of money that we would hope to to run a site of this size. To give you an example, um, Business Insider, when they looked at us as an organization, said that, and this is their determination, that if we were a for-profit entity, we would be a $4 billion company. $4 billion dollar company. And we would then have the equivalent resources of a $4 billion company to maintain the site and its infrastructure. So you can imagine that amounts to tens of thousands of employees and hundreds of millions of dollars in investment in server infrastructure. In reality, we're doing that for less than $20 million. You figure we're functioning out of this entire operation off of two floors in an office building in San Francisco that's very sparsely furnished in the grand scheme of things. And then basically we have the new primary data center we just put it up, um, and the, the, the original data center we have in Florida, and then a, a caching site in Amsterdam, and then that's it. The way we spent money last year, just to kind of give you an overview, essentially I'm kind of working off our audit, which will be made available on our, our website. Um, our, our revenues um, were about $24 million total, and our expenses were a little under um, $18 million. Anytime you monetize something like Wikipedia or its other related projects, you start getting influences over what is appropriate content. Our goal is not to generate profits. By having a 501c3 status and being a not-for-profit, we hopefully can maintain a higher level of independence. The primary thing we need money for is the thing I think most people want us to get money for, which is to preserve and improve the data infrastructure that supports Wikipedia and the other wiki projects under the foundation. One of the things we find is that we have a very high uh, fundraising efficiency and that for every dollar raised, we only spend about eight cents. We, the organization, I think, uh, as of last measure, had about $15 million in the bank. For us, this is about six months of operating. Our goal at the end of the day would be to have a full year's worth of operating um, in the bank. So we're talking somewhere between, you know, 20, given our current budget, probably around $27 million. That sounds like a lot of money to a lot of people, you know, especially across the globe. When you start talking about having reserves, having $15 million in the bank, that sounds like an awful lot of money. Well, from an individual's perspective, they're right. It is an awful lot of money. But when it comes to keeping you know, the data center running, the team in place to keep that data center running, to be able to make the grants to the chapters so they can do the outreach work, to expand the participation of the editor community, it turns into a very small amount of money. It's six months worth of operating. We have to make very strategic choices, and so we therefore have to hold ourselves to very high standards about making sure we're getting good outcomes with the money that we invest in any given area, whether it's technology, global development, how much we, we spend on our fundraiser, folks like myself who are there to support the work, the good work of the foundation. Those all things are very careful equations in terms of making sure we're getting the right amount of impact.